Local elections are underway in parts of Ukraine that Russia claims as its own. An effort by officials there, installed by Russia, to cement their authority as the war continues. Reuters journalists in the Russian-controlled city of Mariupol watched as some residents cast their vote after showing their new Russian passports to officials. We hope there will be peace. Naturally, I think everyone hopes for that. It's desirable that peace comes as soon as possible. Many have already fled Russian-occupied territories like this. Such areas have seen some of the worst damage of the war. Vadim Boychenko is the exiled Ukrainian mayor of the city. Now in Kyiv, he told Reuters that Mariupol residents are being ordered to vote at gunpoint, a claim which couldn't immediately be verified. He calls it a sham election. They're going to walk from apartment to apartment as they did before, talking to people. There are two soldiers standing nearby carrying machine guns and they tell the people that they must vote. People open their doors, they get scared and answer, all right, whatever needs to be done, I'll do it. Russia doesn't fully control any of the four regions where the votes are being held, Donetsk, Luhansk, Zaporizhia, and Kherson. They each have governors hand-picked by Moscow, all members of President Vladimir Putin's political coalition called United Russia. 